Hey guys, welcome to my very first YouTube review. Today we are reviewing Shein. I have no idea how to say that or if I even said it correctly, but we're gonna hope it's called Shein. We are reviewing Shein plus size bathing suits. I have some cosmetics, some accessories, and I have a couple of crop tops. I'm gonna give you my super honest review. So I'm gonna explain the process first. So one of my favorite things about Shein is the simplicity of ordering. I have the app, it looks just like this. And um, you can search everything on the app by size if necessary. So you can click women, swimwear, curve and plus, beauty, um, home kids, men, like all the options are at the top. So you can literally just search through things that are your size. Now, here's the rule that I followed when ordering. So anything you order, look at the reviews. The reviews are right here. So like I just pulled up this random top. You can click the reviews and you can read through. The reviews tell you what size was purchased and a lot of them will tell you what size they normally wear, which really, really helps me because I am 5'10". Um, I'm a curvy girl with a small waist and I was torn between regular size and plus size because I don't wear plus size normally, but you know, if it comes from China, I figure it's small. So the reviews really helps me out a lot. So the checkout, um, system is super easy. Um, it's not weird. Like I didn't have any kind of weird charges or anything like that. Um, it was a very seamless process and it actually, the shipping is super quick in my opinion. I've had two orders from Shein and both of them have arrived to my doorstep in less than two weeks. So considering it's coming from China, I feel like that's a win. So without further ado, we shall try on all of the things. Now y'all are about to see my body, okay? I am a curvy girl and I have no shame. So I normally wear a large to extra large. I wear a 38 double D bra and I normally wear a large or an extra large in bottoms as well. Um, if I wanted to be like, this is an extra large t-shirt. If I wanted to be loose, I wear an extra large. So keep that in mind. I'll tell you what size I got, how it fits, and I'll be right back with the very first thing and my favorite. This is my favorite crop top. This one was actually, I think about $4, $4. And it's a 2XL, okay? So I went up one size based on the reviews. And I actually probably could have gotten the 1X, which is a size 14, um, and it would have been fine. But this one, it gives room. I actually prefer this one without a bra. This is super, like the material is thick, um, but it's not like uncomfortably thick. It does not feel cheaply made. The buttons don't feel, like everything about this shirt this crop top is freaking amazing. And it was $4. Like, I am obsessed. I'm obsessed. This crop top is actually like one of the most reviewed products on Shein. And it says babe and hello. Um, I just got it because I thought it was cute. And I it would be super cute like just to sleep in with some little shorts or whatever. But I do like this one now. This one is a little bit, it does feel a little cheaper. Um, like if you can see the strap is super thin. Um, whatever. But it's fine. For a couple of dollars, I didn't pay more than $5 for it. And I just feel like to sleep in or whatever, it totally works, right? It totally works. It's thick. It's not super thin. Um, the, whatever this is, this is not um, vinyl. It's maybe screen print, so it doesn't feel like this will come off or anything like that. This is it's just cute. It's just a cute little top. I'll probably wear it to sleep in or whatever for five bucks. I feel like it's not a bad deal. Okay, so I had not tried this one on prior to showing you guys, and I actually don't hate it. Now, I bought this because I've seen it so many times um, tagged or whatever on Facebook, and I was like, man, that's so cute. So, obviously, I left my bra on. Okay, look, I'm right neck. But, like, paired with a cute, I have a super light lilac colored blazer and, like, some camouflage shorts. It would be the cutest thing ever. 
it's so cute it doesn't feel super cheap um i do notice like here this one is what size this is a 1x so it's a 14 um and it probably does run a little small um it does seem like here it kind of comes down a little bit of an awkward length but it's totally fine because i wear like a blazer or something with it and the top is just so cute and i think like with some camouflage shorts and some black heels or even just like some converse it will be so cute so i think this one was a little bit more expensive it was around nine dollars but still totally worth it i do i don't know if you guys can see i do notice things like this this one is um stretchy like the band is stretchy but for nine dollars wear a blazer over it and rock on with your bad self girl here is the bathing suit that i ordered i cannot believe i'm showing my bathing suit body on youtube but whatever i'm actually super impressed with this bathing suit um it's very it's not thin at all the cups i do notice i don't know if you guys notice i am a 38 double d like i said the cups are very small how awkward the cups are very small but i don't know how noticeable it is because it looks pretty okay um, this is a 2XL. I would normally wear a large or an extra large. I just followed the comments or the reviews on the um, app and this one seemed to be the best fit and it's perfect. Um, I probably could have gone down a size in the top. The bottoms are a little bit different. Um, the only thing about this bathing suit is it was supposed to be purple. Like on the app, these were purple that's why I ordered it and it came in and they're blue and they're all different colors but you know what it's totally fine because it's super cute this is like a mesh and a little something something and it doesn't feel super thin it doesn't feel it doesn't rip um, I expected it to like if I stretched it you know to hear like that sound and um, I just really love this bathing suit it fits really well um, I just really love it and I think that it was like $11 so $11 for a cute like high-waisted whatever it totally works it totally works for $11 right on to my favorite this is one of my very favorite accessories some of the best things that I have ever gotten from Shein and it is their accessory glasses these are not prescription strength there's nothing no blue light blocking nothing like that they're just for looks but I have ordered five pairs and I love them they're like five bucks. I paid five dollars for these. Um, I have two more pairs. I think I paid a little bit more, like six or seven dollars for those. But they're the quality is crazy good. I have ordered glasses from Amazon, Top Fox, um, Zenny, all of those, and none of the quality was even as good as these five dollar glasses from Shein. These kind of make me feel a little funny. I feel like I got a little teacher look going on, but they're super, like, they're just super good quality. They're not cheap. They don't feel like, um, like they would break, you know? Um, I love them. Here is the other pair. I think they are super cute, like, round frame, like, just super cool. I love these glasses. I think they're, like, definitely a statement piece. Um, they make an outfit, and... I am obsessed these are super heavy super heavy glasses like they're so heavy in this case that I can put all of my other glasses in the other one and these are heavier they're like metal glasses what's up here's the final pair these just make me feel foxy make me feel a little foxy And for the final products, I'm not going to live review them, but I will do a separate video comparing Shein Cosmetics, I think their brand is She Glam, comparing it to a higher end product just to see the difference. But I did want to show you guys, I ordered a contour palette. Um, I do not have it on. Um, I have on a different contour, but I'm not mad at this. The pigment's not that great, but what can you really expect? I think it, this was like $7 maybe. I do have to say the smell <clears throat> is really strong. So if you're conscious of chemicals and things like that on your face, 
then you're probably not going to want to give their line a try because the smell will literally run you out of the room. It is so strong. Um, I also got a contour stick. I want to say this was like $3 maybe. It was super cheap. Um, and the packaging, you can tell, is from China because it's very small. But it's hard to get out. But it just rolls up. This is more what I would normally use. I normally use a stick contour. Um, I don't have this one on, like I said. But the smell is the only thing. <sighs> it is so strong. <laughs> the smell is so strong. Um, it's probably definitely not good for your skin. But you know what? It's okay because we're going to try it out. <laughs> so catch me for a live review of She Glam versus my brand. Okay? Outtake. This shirt has been shown on my counter a long time. I am giving away a $50 gift card to Shein for sharing this video on your social media. If you will, please tag me and follow the Amanda Allen, and I will know you shared. I will draw. Uh, I will draw. Uh, I will draw a name and give away a $50 gift card. I will message you and get your information and send it on just for being a supporter. This is my first ever video. It was super fun. I hope it was helpful. And I hope you guys go and grab you some crop tops from Shein without questioning whether you can wear them or not. Because girl, you can.